Have you been running an SEO campaign for your property management company, but you're frustrated with the results? You're not seeing any real increases in traffic to your website and no increases in lead flow? In today's video, I'm gonna to talk to you about the six main reasons we see SEO campaigns are not performing. So the first reason that we see very often is the SEO campaign is not regularly being fed new content, meaning you're not regularly producing new content or you are producing new content, but that content is not optimized for search engines. Simply putting up a piece of content on your website does not mean that Google understands what that content is about. So you need to be regularly producing content that is well optimized for search engines, that is going after keywords that people in your market being rental property owners are regularly searching for in order for it to start to have an effect and actually bring in traffic in that be, meaning people to find your website. The second reason that we see SEO campaigns not performing well is that you have a ton of what we call thin content. So this happens when you're regularly producing content, but you're not producing really good quality content. And a quick guideline should be, you shouldn't have any pages on your website that are under 700 words of text. If they're under 700 words, then they definitely need to have rich media, meaning a video on the page to go along with it. Or you should no index that page, meaning you tell Google, although this page is relevant for our users, we don't want you to serve it up in your search engine and we don't want you to waste your crawl budget when you're crawling our website on this page. So that will work because basically you're telling Google, don't waste your time on this page. The reason we have it is for operational purposes, but it's not important from a search engine standpoint. So don't waste your time trying to understand what it's about. The third thing that we see most often with companies that are running an SEO campaign, but not getting any results is they're not building up backlinks on a regular basis to their website. A backlink is when you get another website out there to reference your website. Often you wanna to try to get a backlink from sites that have a lot of traffic, from other websites that are relevant to the real estate industry, or other websites that are relevant to your local market. And you want to be uh, basically consistently building up these backlinks in order to get more authority to your website. So you can kind of look at a backlink like a vote. And if Google sees that your website has enough votes from other websites out there that are relevant, they'll start to pay more attention to it. They'll go, oh, if all these other websites out there are referencing, you know, abcpropertymanagementcompany.com's website, then it's probably of significance. We should probably show it to more of our search engine users. So keep that in mind. You need to regularly be performing backlink campaigns to get other websites out there to reference your website and build backlinks to your website. The fourth thing that we see companies making the mistake of is not consistently getting reviews. Reviews are incredibly important for two factors. One, if you want people to reach out to you, whether they find out about you online or offline, they're going to go and check up your company's review profile. So make sure you have good reviews from that standpoint. The second factor is from an SEO standpoint. Having re reviews are very important for a local SEO campaign, which in your, the case of your property management company, is extremely important. So basically make sure that you're regularly and consistently getting reviews to your Google business profile and answering those reviews. So don't just get a ton of reviews and never respond to them. Make sure that you answer them as well and make sure that you focus on Google for those reviews because those are the ones that really matter from an SEO standpoint. Getting reviews on Yelp or Facebook are good, but they're not really gonna have much benefit for you um, when it comes to your SEO campaign. The next mistake we, people, we see people make all the time with an SEO campaign is not having enough internal links throughout their website. An internal link is when you have one page on your website that links to another page on your website. Usually that's done via text, meaning if there's a paragraph on page A and it's talking about something relevant to another page on your website, maybe you have a page on your website about maintenance, that paragraph that there's text from that paragraph on page A that links to that page that's talking about maintenance. Internal links are the way that Google discovers different pages on your website and they look at the number of internal links pointing to a particular page to determine its importance. So 
If you have a page on your website that you're targeting for a specific keyword that's very important for your business, it should theoretically have a very high amount of internal links pointing towards it from other pages on your website because you wanna make sure that Google understands that this page is extremely important for us. So make sure you get your internal linking down straight. Otherwise, you're gonna have a really hard time showing up in search engines and you're not gonna be able to generate a significant amount of traffic and as a result, a significant amount of leads from your website. Now the sixth mistake we see people make all the time is not giving SEO enough time. It's tough, it's frustrating, you have to wait a long time for Google to really start to take note of all the work that you've been putting in, but that's also what separates the, fly, the people that are basically trying to make money really quickly and the people that are trying to build a sustainable business. And Google's aware of this. If they made it super easy for everybody to show up in, in, on page one right away, it wouldn't really make much sense, right? How would every company out there be able to show up quickly? They wanna see which companies are willing to put in consistent effort and regularly be updating and maintaining their website so that basically Google knows they can trust this website. This is a, a real business, an established business that is willing to put in the effort and provide good quality information to any people we send to it from our search engine. So keep those six mistakes in mind. Go reanalyze your SEO campaign, look at what you're doing, or if you want an outsider's opinion, feel free to reach out to us at Upkeep Media. If you're looking to grow your business, sign up for one of our growth marketing sessions. It's a free 30 minute educational session, and we'll walk you through what some of your competitors are doing to bring on new properties to manage. We'll take a look at where you're currently positioned from an online standpoint. So we'll even take a look at your current SEO campaign and the different keywords that you're showing up for in Google. And we'll give you recommendations you can look to implement regardless of whether or not we work together so that no matter what, you walk away from that meeting with value. Thanks so much. Hope you like this video. Please hit the like button, give us a subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.